Hi y'all, my name is Gina. Welcome to Honey Hole Junkin. It's been a while since I um, put a video out. I know it's after Christmas, but I'm gonna um, video my kitchen and um, I wanna show you what I did for Christmas before I take it down because I don't um, wanna not show you guys. Um, hope you had a Merry Christmas and all the good stuff that goes with it, friends and family and um, with further ado, let's get into the video. I'm going to start on my cheer tray and show you what I did. I It's not as um, full of a share, but I um, used what I had left over. I um, put let it snow a little plaque on there and I got the Santa from Walmart. It's an ornament. And I thought that was cute and put that there. And then I got um, these Santa mugs. I got them at a thrift store that I like to go to. And they're so cute. I got a set of them, I think for like three bucks. And that was really a good deal. And then down here, going around at the bottom, I put a, a, can, or a candle holder and then I put an ornament on top. I got those two at the same thrift store, a bunch of um, vintage ornaments, and so I put one there. And then some greenery and some pit, um, berry picks that I had with the little bells on it, and I just thought that was cute. And then another little um, Santa mug, or cup, I should say. Little cup. And back up here is a bottle brush tree and that one's my tear tray for 2023 this year take it back around and look let me get a close-up on this he, this is really cute it fell down let me fix it yeah let us know i got them ornaments i can't remember where i got them but i've had them for a while I need to get some more stuff for my tear tray for next year. Some smaller stuff to put on there. Okay, now we're going to go over here to my plate rack. And these are the plates I always use. I just love them. Them are the um, Heritage Collection from Walmart. They don't have them no more. And they're better homes and garden. And I collected Oh, for a long time for them. And I just love them. See the, and that was a little glare. Sorry for the glare, it's the window. And then one down here, it's got a little rabbit. And this is my cabinet. My Santa. I got him at the thrift store too, last year. And the candle ring is thrifted. And my vintage, well, I believe they're vintage. Um, they were 2001 or something like that, but I just thought they were really cute. And there's another plate. And then another um, coffee cup that goes with this other one. I just thought that was cute. And then I put a bottle brush tree, bottle brush tree. <laughs> and then the plaid little napkin, I got them at Hobby Lobby this year and I just thought those were so cute. And then the another plate, salad plate that I collected. And I'll stand back and show you. Oh, and then I put a little sock stocking on there on the door. Show you again. Kept my chalkboard. And then my tree in the kitchen I know I have trees everywhere I just love trees especially at Christmas and um, the bucket down there um, I got that from my son's farm he was gonna throw it away and I thought oh no I can use that as a tree put a tree in and I'll get down here and show you it's um, tin and it's old and stuff on it and um, my ornaments and then I got some vintage ornaments this year for the tree 
Yeah, and then I made this one here. I got some vintage paper and then I decoupaged them on there. And then I put a, a velvet ribbon on it and there's my star. Oh, yeah. I'll show you my vintage ornaments. These are my vintage ornaments. They're Santa Clauses. And then um, on the back side it says Merry Christmas. And then it's got, I'll turn it around. Sorry, y'all. It says Merry Christmas on that one. There's one down here. It's got the bells on it. Yeah. Well, it turned out pretty good. Not too bad. And then I got these um, Santa ornaments from um, Walmart this year. I just thought they were so cute. For my tree. And then on over to my other shelf that I always decorate. Here's what it looks like all together. And then my pictures from Hobby Lobby quite a few years ago. I got that. And then that's another one of the heritage um, collection that goes with the plates with the little deer and looking up. And some more of them cups that I found. I just thought they were cute up there. And then also the tree I've had that wooden tree with the metal on it for forever. I can't remember where I got it. And then another one of them vintage ornaments. Let me get this out of the way. And it has like a scene, barn scene on it. Then I got a red bird, some greenery. And then my stockings. I always hang them there. I just love Love how it looks. And then back around on top of my refrigerator while he puts Christmas magnets up. I've had them for quite a while too. And then here's on top of my refrigerator. Now that's the platter that goes with all them um, dishes over there in my plate rack. And I just put a little green ring. And then I got the Santa um, at the same thrift store I like to go to and then I just put a tree in there and tied a little ribbon on it and I just thought that was so cute and then over here in this corner I um, put this little basket that I got at a yard sale and I just thought it was really cute with all the berries and stuff and the um, bells and here's some more of those Santa mugs and I got a bottle tr a bottle tree um, from Dollar General, and I just thought that was cute. And then I put another little frosted tree <clears throat> to go with a little frosty um, greenery in there. And then my wooden um, cutting board. Get this out of the way so you can see it. And then my um, white pitchers, ironstone. And I put the little um, um, spatula in there with the deer. And the little bird on it. I just thought he was so cute. I got that at Walmart last, or Hobby Lobby last year. And that's that. And moving over here, in this corner, I didn't do as much as this year as I normally do. But I wanted to show you the little um, wall plug in I got it from Bath and Body Works. I just thought that was cute. That goes so well in this house with two dogs and a cat. <laughs> Yeah, just thought that was cute. And then here on my bread box, I just got the wooden box I always usually have up there. And then I put some um, dish cloths in there and then the little, the deer napkins. I just set them in there. And then there's another plate back there. And then over here is the coffee station. And then I got two little, um, Santa mugs, I got them from Dollar Tree this year. I just thought they were cute. They were just really cute. Should I close up? Yeah, they're really cute. And then down here, um, another, well, that wooden tree I got at a thrift store. And then some more of those mugs. And 
And then we'll keep going this way. And then I just put some soap, hand soap I got from Bath and Body. And these little guys, they're salt and pepper shakers and they are vintage and I got them at the thrift store. I just thought those were so cute. I hope you can see them without the glare from the window. And then up here, I always have that, um, I guess towel rack, I want to say, up there. And then I put one of those plaid um, napkins up there that I got from Holly Lobby. And the, the deer dish towel, I've always, I've had that for a long time too. And I think I got that at Walmart years ago. And then I got some new greenery. I got those at Walmart. I just thought they were cute. Get ready and put a little bow. And then moving on over here. And then on my pantry door, I put this wreath and um, uh, velvet ribbon. And I thought that was cute. Well, that's um, what I've done in the kitchen. And I'll take you back around and let you look get you like an overview of it all over here and then down here hope in the new year I can learn how to video better <laughs> it's practice so much practice it's you have to do a lot of practice in doing this and but I'll get better and then that's that that's my kitchen well I hope you enjoyed it all and hopefully you got some inspiration for next year. I know, like I said in, in the beginning, I just wanted to sh take you on the tour a little bit to show you what I did. Thanks y'all for um, hanging out with me today and seeing my kitchen for 2023. So hope you all have a great day, a great week, and I hopefully I'll see you soon.